Dinosaurs are undoubtedly the most fascinating creatures to have ever existed on Earth. These prehistoric giants were some of the most diverse and awe-inspiring animals to have ever roamed our planet. But among them, there were a few that stood out due to their colossal size and impressive physical features. In this video, we'll be taking a look at the top 10 biggest dinosaurs ever discovered. Number 10. Saurophaganax Saurophaganax is a genus of large thoropod dinosaur that lived during the late Jurassic period, approximately 150 million years ago. It was a carnivorous predator that measured up to 12.2 meters in length and weighed around 2.5 tons. Saurophaganax is known for a single partial skeleton discovered only in Oklahoma, USA in the 1930s. It was originally named Megaraptor but later reclassified as Saurophaganax. Despite its large size, Saurophaganax had relatively short arms and may have relied on its powerful jaws and legs to capture and kill prey. Its fossils are important for understanding the diversity and evolution of large theropod dinosaurs during the Jurassic period. Number 9. Gigantosaurus Gigantosaurus is a genus of large theropod dinosaur that lived in what is now Argentina during the late Cretaceous period, approximately 99.6 to 97 million years ago. It was one of the largest known meat-eating dinosaurs, and it's estimated to have grown up to 12.4 meters 40 feet in length and weighed up to 8 tons. Gigantosaurus had long, sharp teeth and powerful jaws that it likely used to prey on large herbivorous dinosaurs such as the Argentinosaurus. It also had a long, slender tail and powerful hind legs that would have allowed it to move quickly and efficiently. Gigantosaurus was discovered in the mid-1990s and has since become a popular subject of study for paleontologists. Its discovery challenged the previously held belief that the Tyrannosaurus rex was the largest meat-eating dinosaur, and it helped to shed light on the diversity and evolution of large theropods in the late Cretaceous period. Number 8. Spinosaurus Spinosaurus is a genus of large theropod dinosaur that lived during the late Cretaceous period, approximately 112 to 93.5 million years ago. It was first described in 1915 and is known for its distinctive sail-like structure on its back, which may have been used for display or thermal regulation. Spinosaurus is one of the largest known carnivorous dinosaurs, with estimates of its length ranging from 12 to 18 meters, 39 to 59 feet, and its weight ranging from 7 to 20.9 tons, 7.7 .7 to 23 short tons. It had a long, narrow snout filled with conical teeth and was likely a piscivore, meaning it's primarily fed on fish. The fossils of Spinosaurus have been found in North Africa, particularly in Egypt and Morocco. The discovery of new Spinosaurus fossils in recent years has led to significant controversy and debate among paleontologists about the dinosaur's anatomy, behavior, and ecological niche. Number 7. Maposaurus Maposaurus was a large theropod dinosaur that lived during the late Cretaceous period approximately 100 to 80 million years ago in what is now Argentina. It is estimated to have been up to 40 feet long and weighed up to 8 tons. Maposaurus was closely related to another large theropod, Gigantosaurus, and was part of the family of the Caracarodontosauridae. Maposaurus is known from a limited number of fossils, but they suggest that it had strong jaws and sharp teeth adapted for tearing flesh. It likely hunted in packs, which would have allowed it to take down large prey such as a sauropod dinosaur. Maposaurus is an important dinosaur because it provides insights into the evolution and behavior of large theropod dinosaurs during the late Cretaceous period. Before proceeding further, please subscribe to the channel and click on the notification icon so you'll get notified when we upload the next video. Number 6. Tyranotitan Tyranotitan is a genus of carnivorous theropod dinosaur that lived during the late Cretaceous period, around 90 million years ago in what is now Argentina. It was first described in 2005 and is known for several partial skeletons and isolated bones. Tyranotitan is estimated to have been 12 to 13 meters long and weighed around 6 to 7 tons. It had a large deep skull with numerous sharp teeth and its body, and it's likely relied on its strong hind legs for movement and hunting. Tyranotitan is classified as a member of the Carcharodontosauridae family, which includes other large theropod dinosaurs such as Gigantosaurus and Maposaurus. Number 5. Carcharodontosaurus 
Carcharodontosaurus is a genus of carnivorous dinosaur that lived in what is now North Africa during the late Cretaceous period, about 100 million years ago. It was one of the largest theropod dinosaurs with an estimated length of up to 45 feet and a weight of up to 8 tons. Carcharodontosaurus had a long, narrow skull with serrated teeth that could reach over 8 inches in length. It likely hunted large herbivorous dinosaurs such as sauropods in packs. Fossils of Carcharodontosaurus have been found in Morocco, Algeria, and Tunisia. The name Carcharodontosaurus means shark tooth lizard, reflecting the shape and size of its teeth. Number 4. Acrocanthosaurus Acrocanthosaurus is a genus of theropod dinosaur that lived during the early Cretaceous period, approximately 112 to 100 million years ago. It was a large predator that measured up to 11.5 meters, 38 feet in length, and weighed around 5.8 tons. Acrocanthosaurus, it was named for the high spines on its back, which were thought to have supported a sail-like structure. It had a long, narrow skull filled with sharp teeth and powerful jaws capable of delivering a deadly bite. Fossils of Acrocanthosaurus have been found in the United States, primarily in Oklahoma and Texas. It likely preyed on large herbivorous dinosaurs like sauropods and orinthopods. Despite its fearsome reputation, the Arcanthosaurus may have faced competition from other large predators like Allosaurus and Spinosaurus. Number 3. Dreadnoughtus Dreadnoughtus is a genus of supermassive titanosaurian sauropod dinosaurs that lived about 77 million years ago during the late Cretaceous period. It was first discovered in 2005 in Argentina and it remains as one of the most complete of any giant dinosaurs ever found. Dreadnoughtus weighed about 65 tons and measured around 85 feet in length, making it one of the largest known land animals to have ever existed. Its name, meaning fears nothing, reflects its massive size and the fact that it likely had a few predators. Due to its completeness, scientists have been able to learn a great deal about its anatomy, including its musculature and movement. Dreadnoughtus is an important species for understanding the evolution and behavior of giant sauropods in the late Cretaceous. Number 2. Patagotitan Patagotitan is a genus of sauropod dinosaur that lived approximately 100 million years ago during the late Cretaceous period. It is considered one of the largest animals that ever existed with estimated lengths of up to 37 meters 121 feet, and weight of 69 tons. Fossils of Patagotitan were first discovered in 2010 in Argentina and the genus was formally described in 2017 based on several specimens, including a nearly complete skeleton. Its name comes from the Patagonia region where it was found, combined with the Greek word Titan, which means large. Patagotitan belonged to the group of sauropods known as Titanosaurus, which were characterized by their long necks and tails, small heads, and four pillar-like legs. It likely fed on plants using its long neck to reach high branches, and it may have traveled in herds for protection against predators. The discovery of Patagotitan has provided valuable insights into the evolution and anatomy of the largest dinosaurs that ever lived. Number 1. Argentinosaurus Argentinosaurus is a genus of sauropod dinosaur that lived during the late Cretaceous period around 94 million years ago in what is now Argentina. It is one of the largest land animals ever discovered with estimates of its length ranging from 30 to 40 meters, 98 to 130 feet, and its weight from 60 to 100 tons. The first fossils of Argentinosaurus were first discovered in 1987 in the Nequim province of Argentina by a team of paleontologists led by Jose F. Bonaparte. These fossils include vertebrae, limb bones, and pelvic bones. Further excavations over the years have yielded more complete skeletons, allowing scientists to understand this massive dinosaur a bit better. Due to its incomplete fossil record, much about the biology and behavior of the Argentinosaurus remains unknown. However, it is believed to have been an herbivore, using its long neck to reach high into trees for food. Its massive size would have made it virtually immune to predators. Although juvenile specimens may have been vulnerable to attack from large carnivorous dinosaurs such as Gigantosaurus. What are your thoughts about these dinosaurs? Let us know in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed watching the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like these.